From the first of the year to last Sunday night when police say a relationship ended with a murder-suicide on Goldsmith Lane. Oh, sad, very sad. Domestic violence has touched more than a dozen families in the worst way possible. So far this year, LMPD has investigated 13 domestic violence related homicides. Seven of those happened in January alone. You know, I don't know that it's any more of a problem in Louisville as it is in other communities. Um, I just, but I, the numbers here concern me a lot. Elizabeth Wessels Martin is with the Center for Women and Families. She knows how these crimes can rock a community. In September, police say Dana Hodges was shot and killed outside her church by her ex-boyfriend who tried unsuccessfully to kill himself. Um, of course, they're, they're very much grieving Dana's death. Um, it has impacted the entire church family um, and her son and her daughter and her mother. But from that, there's been a lot of conversation and, and um, the pastor of that church has said, we have to talk about this. We can't keep this stuff secret. Wessels Martin says victims should feel comfortable talking about abuse. Don't wait till it gets physically dangerous before you start screaming for help. Because she says there are people ready to listen, offer shelter, and hope for the future. Talk about it. Don't keep it a secret anymore. It's nothing to be ashamed of. For more information about the resources offered by the Center for Women and Families, just visit WLKY.com. I'm Morgan Lentis, WLKY News.